Welcome to Mac 2024. We're here on the Heidenheim stand and we're finding out about the brand new TNC7 control from Dan Johnson, the MD of Heidenheim uh, UK. And also we're going to be finding out from David Sayers about some brand new features. And Daniel, congratulations on this brand new release of TNC7. It looks pretty nice. Yeah, we're really proud to launch our new TNC7 and Mac here. Yeah, it's a fantastic piece of kit. It looks on the front end, but people kind of forget that there's actually, there's a lot going on behind the scenes inside the machine tool that changes as well. Yeah, so we've not only got the new control, we've got new drives in the back. We've also got a new range of linear encoders. Uh, all designed as a whole new package uh, that we're launching with the control. Yeah, absolutely. And there's a lot of benefits to the whole, the system as a whole. But why should machine tool operators and owners invest in modern machine control technology? So, we like to think there's the whole concept of the total cost of ownership. You know, you're investing a lot of money into a, a machine tool, and the control is just a, a part of that package. This control will hopefully give you a much quicker return on investment over the life of the machine. Because it's not just the control here, you're talking about the time uh, to set up your job, the time to set up and get, get machining. And if your machine is not cutting metal, it's costing you money. Our linear encoders are also designed in that respect, so we're trying to save you not only electric electricity costs uh, by reducing the need for air purge, but also we're, just, we're trying to make sure that your machine stays running and that you get more cutting time out of it. It's really important when energy costs are a rising factor in uh, the commercial calculations of a business, um, especially one that uses a machine tool, um, but there's also features for operators as well that's going to hopefully reduce the energy cost, reduce the machine downtime. Yeah, Rowan, so this is really important. So we've got dynamic collision monitoring too, and we've got opt optimized contour milling. This is really important to reduce your cycle times and increase uh, the life of your tools. So we found uh, from our database, using our database, we can get those down um, so it by about a third and also uh, increase your tool life by up to a half. And as with new software and new controls, people are always a little bit wary that they're going to have to learn something completely different. How easy is it to get up to speed on a brand new TNC7 if you've done a bit of Heidenheim programming before? So we've tried to make sure that the concept of Heidenheim is if you use one of our older controls, you can get up and running and be programming in the same respects uh, on the 7. So if you've got a 530, 620 or a 640, 15 minutes and you should be up and running and uh, in no time until customizing your interface, getting machining. Okay, brilliant. So let's get machining with David, who's going to give us some uh, actual live demonstrations. Let's dig into the control and see what features there are available for operators today. David, we just heard from Dan about how easy it is to go from a TNC640 uh -huh. or an older Heidenheim control to the brand new TNC7. Mm -hmm. There's some brand new features on this which you're going to show us, but yeah. is it really that easy? It's, it's, yeah, easy. If you understand 640, you'll catch on to this within five minutes, okay. basically. Yeah. Brilliant. We're going to see okay. some new features now that yep. make programming mm -hmm. even easier for operators. Yep. What yep. are those features? So, with this, you can have multiple screens open on the 640, you couldn't. You can still bring a uh, document in, but you couldn't. You have to keep swapping between the screens. So now you can see all, everything on one screen. Um, Brilliant, so I see you've positions. got a 2D drawing yeah. here. Mm -hmm. uh, and you're going to show us what you're going to yep. do with this 2D drawing. So just going to show you how quick it is to create this part within the drawing function, with the new free, free contour drawing. And then we're going to program and we're going to put a, a, a contour on. And then we're going to bring in the OCM functions and we're going to show how easy it is to simulate. Okay, brilliant. Yeah. I'm, okay. I won't be timing you, but let's go. <laughs> go. Right. So you're so, bringing up yeah, a different so window. Can, so I've got a different window here. So within here, I can set my working area. Uh, okay, and this yeah. is like a canvas. Okay. Uh, within the sketching, I can... Uh, Depends how fat your fingers are. Yeah, okay. Yeah. I think I'll be set, on the large. Set that to there. I'll set it to medium. I've only got little hands. Uh, we, can, we can then go to sketching and we can draw a line. Wow, yeah. brilliant. So this is a almost circle. fantastic. It's so like it's, a touchscreen CAD yeah, system. Yeah, yeah. So now I can pick up this. I can set this to my center. I can set my uh, radius. Yeah, and you're following this 2D drawing here. Yeah. So at this point here, 30 millimeters, yeah. Okay, wow. so now I can drag this across, turn the sketching off, I can say export, 
I want to set my point on here or I can type it in manually. I can, it's easier just to take it straight off there, yeah? Okay, and then I can say generate. Wow. It generates the program. And so that was a new feature of yeah. the drawer console, yeah. but mm -hmm. you're actually generating con code that people yeah, have used with the hide control. uh, controls. Yeah, They'll everybody will recognize that, yeah, Light, linear, circle center, circle, yeah. I can paste, now I can paste this into my program. I can call this a name. Yeah. Nice. Okay. Oop. Try that again. Yeah. Okay, paste this into my program. And once you paste it yeah. into your program, you can use it to yeah. do roughing cycles, finishing mm -hmm. cycles. Yeah, so that's what I'll show you next. Okay, so I can then pull my program back up. So I have my program over here now. Drag this over. Yeah. Now I can go to here. I can say insert my NC functions. If I've got our templates saved here, OCM complete, I can paste this in. It's all my tool calls, my raw material everything in here I can then say I want to simulate yeah start a simulation wow and you can see and the can coil or milling screen. cycle yeah. mm -hmm. that's been developed just for yeah. this contour mm -hmm. and it's almost like a fully featured yeah. CAD system inside yeah. CAD CAM system inside yeah. your machine control yeah. so we can speed that up slow it down however much we want fantastic yeah. so and what are the watch. benefits of this for operators who are going to be uh, using this every day the speed of doing it really is you, you see how quick we've done that, yeah? Normally that would take you, you've then got to put in your cycles, your machining um, data and everything else. This is all pre-saved from your tool page straight into the control. Brilliant, so that's yeah. one of the many new features on the TNC7 available now from Heidenheim and it's not that hard to pick up if you've programmed Heidenheim before.